so dear students in thumbnail you have already seen the title okay of my today's point that is first order linear differential equation so i have a huge title here no so maybe you are thinking it's quite a difficult concept title is huge don't worry it's very simple concept we are going to discuss in details okay actually in this video i am going to cover the concept when we say the given differential equation is first order linear differential equation second i am going to discuss few examples with you okay third i am going to discuss the applications where we can use this first order differential equations what are the applications of it after that we will see how to find its solution okay actually in this video i am going i am not going to solve any problem in my upcoming videos actually i am going to prepare a complete playlist on this first order linear differential equation in that playlist i am going to solve plenty of problems those will be definitely useful useful for you if you are going to study this first order linear differential equation at the end of each video i am going to give you one homework problem okay so after watching the video you supposed to solve that homework problem on your own and if you face any difficulty or if you want to cross check your answer you can write to me you can mention in comment okay as well as if the problem is quite difficult in next video i am going to discuss that homework problem also so you can cross check your answer or if you have any difficulty you, you will easily get an idea how to solve okay so let us talk about this first order linear differential equation so tell me how many words are there 1 2 3 4 5 5 words are there so let us try to understand their meanings one by one you know the meaning of equation equation means what if you have any mathematical expression with equal to sign equal to getting then we call it as a equation next is differential that means derivatives are involved and we call it as a differential equation first two words is first order what is meaning of first order actually i have already covered in my previous playlist but let us tell me again first order that means you know derivatives are there this is first order derivative this is second order derivative so if you have the differential equation with only first order derivative then we call it as a first order differential equation right and the middle word is still remaining that is linear it means its degree is also one degree that means power okay but see this differential equation has a standard format if okay so uh, let me tell you the expression first dy by dx plus py is equal to q so if you are given differential equation in this format okay or it can be convert into this format given differential equation then we call it as a first order linear differential equation okay so let us compare equation means equal to sign differential means derivative first order order is one first derivative is only involved and linear that means it should be in this format so maybe you are confused what is p what is q let me tell you p means function of x function of x only and q is also having a same meaning function of x only okay so here the condition is p and q must be function of x it means y or you can say independent variable should not be there or getting constants you may have there in, in, uh, in at a place of p and q constants or functions of x right so that is all about p and q let us discuss few examples so you will get a clear cut idea okay how how does this differential equation look or like that example okay first dy by dx plus x square y is equal to e raised to x so let us see the given differential equation is first order linear differential equation or not how many terms are there 1 2 3 we have also 1 2 3 in right hand side we have a one term okay q which is a function of x we have also same py some function of x into y we have the same pattern function of x which is x square into y and the first term is always dy by dx we have it it means it is a first order linear differential equation now the next question is what is p what is q tell me what is p what is q so p is x square and q which is e raised to x that's it okay so that is first order linear differential equation right so now i am giving next problem to you hmm. and you have to tell me what is p and what is q
ओके सो टेल मी वॉट इज पी एंड वॉट इज क्यू इज इट इन द सेम फॉर्मेट हाउ मेनी टर्म्स आर देर वन टू थ्री वन टू थ्री राइट डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इट इज ऑलवेज अ फर्स्ट टर्म ओके मल्टीपल ऑफ वाई दैट इज अवर पी इट मीन्स अवर पी इज टू टेन एक्स एंड राइट हैंड साइड विच इज क्यू सिक्स स्क्वेर एक्स P and Q are functions of x. That's it. So this is over P and S is over Q. So these are few examples of first order linear differential equation. Now let us talk about the second next point that is applications. Why we are going to study this first order linear differential equation and what is its importance? So if you are a uh, engineering student or if you are studying physics along with mathematics, you must be familiar with RC circuit and RL circuit. रेजिस्टेंस इंडक्टेंस सर्किट्स एंड रेजिस्टेंस कैपेसिटर सर्किट टू एनालाइज दो सर्किट द फर्स्ट ऑर्डर लिनियर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन आर इन रिक्वायर्ड गेटिंग सो यू यू एबल टू सॉल्व द फर्स्ट ऑर्डर लिनियर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन टू एनालाइज सच सर्किट एज वेल एज मे बी यूर फैमिली विथ न्यूटन लॉ ऑफ कूलिंग सो दैट फिनोमिना ऑल्सो कैन बी एक्सप्रेस विद हेल्प ऑफ दिस फर्स्ट ऑर्डर लिनियर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन Uh, in case of uh, biology okay biological sciences you know how the disease are spreading that thing can be analyzed or expressed with the help of this first order linear differential equation right many more applications it uh, it has if you are preparing a model based on air pollution or uh, water pollution getting so in that or a, any climate change so in those cases also the first order linear differential equations are involved and many more applications it has so now it is very important topic from exam point of view as well as it has very applications also right so let us talk about how to find its solution okay how to find its solution we are going to discuss if you want make a screenshot of it then i will move further okay so i am sure you won't believe in the process of finding its solution only two steps are involved only two steps see in my previous playlist i already covered exact and reducible to exact differential equation those were so much lengthy not complicated though were those were very simple but see problems were lengthy but here only two steps are involved and with the help of by performing two steps directly we get the answer okay so let me write the its standard form it is dy by dx plus py is equal to q so if you have first order linear differential equation you will easily get p and q which are functions of x the first step is integrating factor so what is integrating factor this concept i have already covered in exact and reducible to exact differential equation if you want you can watch those videos and you will get an idea i'm avoiding the repetition here okay so in integrating factor that thing we have to find and it has very simple formula it is e raised to integration p dx whatever the p we get we should put it here so maybe you are con confused what i have written e raised to in a powers of e we have to we are finding the integration okay in the powers of e so if you are not much comfortable with integration okay you can split this step in two further steps that is you can solve this integration separately and then you can put the value it here otherwise you can directly solve if you are comfortable with integration right so this is the first step you have to solve this integration in a powers of e and you will get an integrating factor and the second step is solution okay directly we are getting the solution just by obtaining this integrating factor the solution is y e raised to integration p dx that means the same factor i am writing it here if you get its value for example x x square x cube you can directly put it here and you will get it is equal to integration e raised to integration p dx that means the same term i am using it here again into q dx plus c that said this is a solution okay so right hand side nothing to do since we are getting the value it here but in the uh sorry in left hand side and but in the right hand side we have to solve this integration by solving integration you will get the solution okay so we will stop here in next video i'm going to cover one problem based on this first order linear differential equation so make a screenshot of it then we will stop thank you see you in next video